Hey! In this short tutorial I'll show you how to create a marketplace of digital downloads similar to Creative Market with WordPress. Creative Market is an online marketplace for community-generated digital assets like graphics, fonts, themes and more. The platform simply matches customers with creators and makes money by charging a commission on every transaction. In this tutorial I'm gonna use WordPress, the most popular website building platform, WooCommerce, the most popular e-commerce plugin, and HivePress, a free plugin for building any type of directory and listing websites. Also, I am going to use the TaskHive theme that allows you to build a marketplace of digital downloads in next to no time. It's a lightweight, clean, and highly customizable WordPress theme that is fully compatible with HivePress. TaskHive is not just a theme, but a bundle of premium extensions that has all the required features for building a marketplace of digital downloads out of the box, such as user accounts, private messages, orders and payouts, and so on. You can follow the link in the description to learn more about TaskHive, check its live demo, or ask developers any pre-purchase questions. Ok, let's start with the theme installation and navigate to the WordPress dashboard first. First of all, you need to install the TaskHive theme by going to the Appearance Themes page and clicking Add New. Then click on the Upload Theme button, select the theme zip file to upload and proceed by installing it. Once the theme is activated, you'll get a suggestion to install the recommended plugins. Simply follow the link and then start the installation. Now click on the return link and proceed by activating plugins. When you activate WooCommerce, it will automatically launch its setup wizard. You should go through all the steps to set up payments for your website. But I'll skip it in this video since every website has its own unique details and payment methods. Ok, now you have all the necessary plugins installed. So you can start setting up your marketplace. The first thing you have to do is to navigate to the HivePress settings section and enable the listing attachments. Keep in mind that you can restrict the file types depending on the files you want to sell. And don't forget to save changes. Next, let's add some listing categories specific to the marketplace of digital downloads. For example, let's create several categories that are available on Creative Market, like graphics, fonts and templates. In order to add a new category, go to the Listings Categories section. Here you can enter the category name, let it be Graphics. Here you can turn it into a subcategory by setting a parent category for it. Then fill in the description if necessary and finally you can upload the category image. When finished, click on the Add Category button. In the same way, you can add more categories. There are no limits, so you can add as many categories as required for your marketplace. Once you add the categories, it's time to add some fields specific to the digital download listings. You can add custom listing fields and search filters in the Listings Attributes section. For example, Let's create a selectable license attribute in order to allow users to specify the license for the digital assets they list for sale. Click on the Add New button. Enter the name, allow front-end editing and select the field type. We recommend setting a select field type for this attribute. Then mark it as filterable and sortable and set the search field type. It's better to use the select field type as well. Finally, you can customize a display format if necessary. Once you are done, click on the Publish button. Now you need to mark this field required and add some options by clicking on the Edit Options button. For example, let's add basic, regular and extended options. Similarly, 
you can add as many options as you need for your marketplace. Alright, now let's try to upload a new digital asset. For example, let's add the first listing to the graphics category and do this from the front end to check how it's gonna work for sellers. To do this, go to your website, click on the list and item button and select the graphics category. Here you can upload preview images, then enter the title, let it be vector illustration set, set the price, fill in the description, choose the license type, add tags if necessary, and finally upload your digital asset. When finished, click on the submit listing button. Now, let's check the whole workflow of purchasing and downloading a digital asset as a buyer. To do that, log out from the admin account and register a user account. Click on the sign in button, then click on the register button and fill in the required details. Once you are done with the registration, navigate to the graphics category and locate our previously added listing. As you can see, it's displayed along with our custom field, and we can filter listings by license type. But let's also try to buy this illustration set. Simply click on the Buy Now button, and you'll be redirected to the checkout page where you can provide the billing details. Let's fill in all the required fields to complete the checkout. Once the payment is received, you'll be able to download the purchased file. To do that, navigate to the My Account Orders section and click on the View button. As you can see, there is an option to download the illustration set. That's how it works! Also, if there are any issues with the order, buyers can contact the seller directly via private messages or raise a dispute to contact the site administrator. Finally, let's switch back to the seller account to check the newly created order and try to request a payout. Go to the My Account page. As you can see, there is a chart that provides sellers with a monthly, weekly and daily statistic about their revenue. Also, if there is a non-zero balance, sellers can request a payout by clicking on the Request a Payout link. Keep in mind that as a marketplace owner, you can allow payout requests at any point or set a minimum amount that sellers have to earn before requesting a payout. That's all for today! So, if you want to create a marketplace of digital downloads like Creative Market with WordPress, you may consider using the TaskHive theme along with the HivePress plugin, since they are both lightweight, easy to use and highly customizable. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or you can follow the link in the description to learn more about HivePress, its themes and extensions. Have a great day!